Hi guys, welcome back. Last time I showed you how to make this greenhouse and it comes with a couple different options. You can add the nice pretty trim up there as one option. You can add the door glass framing as another option and you can add additional shelves if you like with options. And then for the roof, you can add framing as well for up here or you can just put your plexi material behind that. Now, this is with the framing option, and then these were just the extra benches. As far as the windows go, I'm going to show you how to do those. And the first thing you need to do is get yourself the little plastic shields. They come in a sheet, and then cut them to fit the windows. And then we're going to glue them on the back. Okay, so I'm using some super glue and I want to have all my windows that I've pre-cut ready and be careful not to get this on your fingers, but you just want to go and do just a tiny bit of glue, not too much. you don't want it to come over on your glass now once I've done that I like to go ahead and take a piece of paper and quickly just dab it on the paper first that way it gets any loose bubbly stuff off of it now I hold it up here careful not to get your fingers stuck to it and I just sandwich the two together just like that and then I just make sure at least three of the sides are square and then if I miscut it or if I made it cut a little bit too big you can trim that off at the end now you want to do that to all of the windows including the long windows on the other side now when you're doing your windows be sure to pick the side that has the cut on the outside for the miter um, to stay on the front and then the back side is where you glue your glass to again just very very little bit of glue and this one's too long for the paper that I have sitting here so I'm just gonna kind of blot it that way sandwich them together now once they're sandwiched together you want to line them up and just glue them right onto the house or the greenhouse I should say all right so here's what you're gonna do is you're gonna go ahead and put a little bit of glue on the edge of that plexiglass just a little bit don't get over excited. Now wood glue will not work for this. Now so I don't have too much glue, I take the paper and I just kind of spread it out just a little bit, but don't go beyond that edge. Now I'm going to go ahead and line my window up. Don't let it touch just yet. Just line it up the way that you want it to go. And then hold it in place for a minute for it to hear. Okay, so then the window goes like that. The next step would be, after you have your side windows on, would be to take a quarter inch piece of wood and place it underneath and then take your framing that you have
dab it on your paper like we just did the other stuff. And then you're going to set the framing on that wood, line it up where you want it to go. Make sure it's even because once you stick it, it's going to stick because it's crazy glue. And this part you can use wood glue for if you like. But make sure it's even at the bottom because it's going to keep you straight with that quarter inch piece of wood sitting there. Or you can use two one eighth inches. And then that's how you install that window. As far as installing the top, you're going to do the same exact thing. Apply crazy glue to your window. Line it up, make sure it's even. And then attach it. Now you'll have this window versus this window, and it just gives it more detail. Right, now for the door handle, the door handle is really easy to do. Your door will come with two holes in it. You will put a little tiny dab of glue, not a lot, right in the handle, and then you will take, pre-paint your handle if you want it paint it, and slide it right in that hole with that. Then you want to go ahead and, okay, so then you just press it in there, remove any excess glue off the back, and let it dry. And then it'll stay attached. You can open and close your door like so. As far as the door glass window, you do the same exact thing we did here and then you just glue it along the inside of the frame. If you want to glue it on the outside of the frame, you're not going to be able to use these hinges. All right, but well that's it. Thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave a question, suggestion, or comment below and I will see you in the next video. I will also post the link below where you can get this kit if you like, and then don't forget to check the options that you want to do with this kit, as there are several options.